Hello YouTube, as I promised in this tutorial we will uh, use this existing form to issue commands that need to be executed on our web server through PHP. So this is totally ugly, let me clarify stuff. Okay, and also I want to delete everything inside of this PHP script because it's a lot of things to think about because we are beginners so yeah label labor for for field uh, label uh, command or something like that and after that we need the uh, input field uh, text of course and name will be command and we don't need a value now let me see what else we can do this because that will probably be ugly as hell form HTML yeah so it's on one line but I don't know I like things on on individual lines so let me see uh, break and yeah maybe one another break okay and up here one let me see yeah something like that who cares anyway so our form is done and let's go to our PHP file so the first thing we need to do is to grab this field okay things from here so let's do that like uh, get command that need to be executed where is my dollar oops yeah post and uh, we are grabbing command right and then down there the thing will be extremely simple just system and let's run that thing so get command and that's it you know that's pretty much it so calculator let's run it through our form okay that works now the funny thing here is we can use one thing in form but we can use it we can run it many times like check this out and we will type only once here application and it will be immediately run three times see scary stuff what a scary thing to do anyway uh, what else notepad or you can use pretty much whatever you like like a ping to Google or any other address man Google will ban my IP I'm pinging it so much definitely we need the pre tag here uh, pre tag and probably yeah sure uh, down there let's close it echo pre and that's pretty much it maybe one horizontal line will be nice here or even here HR and that's pretty much it I think okay go 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 there you go thing works and you have kind of nice here um, line okay so you can also use when you are pinging you can use you know custom number of packets like one and submit and there you go thing will work so here's uh, here's the thing what if we can connect this ping like we can hard code it here with a target that we will grab from form so let's actually do that target ip or domain so target will be filled and here we'll say get target and target and then down there we will concatenate stuff like ping and then space and we will concatenate that with actual target so get target and i think this will work let me see so we don't need to type ping here or any other custom stuff we just need to, well i need to refresh this thing right so let's just say google and come on come on come on 
О, oh, yeah, works. Cool stuff. Cool stuff, bro. So that's pretty much it. So what we are doing here, we are hard coding uh, application and then we have a space because we need it. And then we are grabbing things from form. Now we can also hard code another parameters here, like uh, only one packet. Okay. And then we will just hard codingly custom ping that target with one ping. I don't know what I'm talking about, but we are <laughs> defining here target and then everything will be done on the side of the script. So let's change this to Yahoo. That will be quick. IP address must be specified. Oh yeah, we need the space here. That's stupid. Submit and there you go. Our thing works. So can we use couple of IPs here or domains? Well, sure. So let's let's copy paste this down there. Target two, let's say, and then down there target two. Let's save that. Let's check our form. Cool. And now we need to copy paste this and change it to get target two. Oops. And we will grab that thing and then down there we can just copy paste this code and the thing will work. But we will need to add get target two here. Okay, so we are grabbing two things and we are pinging it individually. I think that will work. Maybe not. I don't know. So uh, one thing will be Google. Another thing will be Bing. Let me see. Oh yeah, so that that works, but we don't know what the hell we are pinging here. So let's print that before. Um, pinging or here echo pinging what we are pinging we are pinging um, get target one okay and then down there let's just copy paste it to here we are pinging get target two i think that's cool so we will not change anything here so submit and now we have what we are ta targeting, but this is also cryptic. So let me just, yeah, H, H2 or something like that, who cares? H2 and also down there, H2, H2. And now we will see better our targets. Oops, submit. There you go. Yeah, cool stuff. Okay, so that's that's pretty much it. Oh, eight minutes tutorial. Damn it. Anyway, in the next tutorial, we will do some kind of similar thing with uh, HTML form probably and switch block of code, something like that. Who cares? Anyway, thank you for watching and see you next tutorial.